Okay, sorry about that. Yeah, apparently I kicked a cable down here and it desynced my my headset, but OBS wouldn't recognize it. So we should be fine now. Alright, let's continue. Hello Siri, hello Fail and Sig, how are you? I was saying that I played the, the, the old fallouts a couple of months or a year back. It seems exactly like them. Pretty much the same. Oh, are you blind? What in God's... I, I mean, better luck next time. Jesus, are you scared my... scarred myself? Holy shit, fighting in the dark is... Azure. It seems like a real issue. Okay, let me check that. Apparently I hurt myself. Horribly. Skills an injury scarred by yourself. What? Jesus night. Least powerful enemy. The kite scout is the most powerful. I don't like that I cannot tell if an enemy is powerful or not from afar. You know that's annoying. Yeah, critical miss. My character, yeah, I was telling you when you asked if this was an anti-mage playthrough. Yeah, this is going to be anti-mage. A hundred percent. Well, anti... Anti... Elf. A dwarf? Please help me, Jesus Christ. That doesn't look good. Oh. This spirit appears to in great pain. Release me, I beg you. The pain. What happened to you? I was cursed by an evil priest. My name was Charles Brego. My friend and I asked only for something to eat. Some sustenance. We were poor, wandering, and he cursed us. My friend, cursed with madness, attacked me, killed me. The pain. I am cursed to be held to this realm, unable to release. Please, I need your help. Alright. What is it that you would have me do? Yeah, I saw a tournament came out yesterday. I actually purchased, I had purchased Andromeda before my GPU died. And now EA doesn't want to give me a refund. They said more than seven days had passed since I, since I had purchased the item. They are giving me a run around. So I will try again when, once the game is released. Try to get a refund. But right now, I saw Dormant came out yesterday, so I said, why not? Let's try to buy it, but I don't have any money anymore. EA has all my money. Let's hope they give them back. Alright. What is it you would have me do? Need to kill the priest, Arbala. He lives here. Only his death will free me, Jesus. I don't know, what will you give me for doing this? I know of a treasure buried for years. You have a deal. Please hurry. Release me from pain. Okay. A bed. Don't think I need to sleep. Jesus. Charles. 
Charles Brago. Holy Jesus Christ, look at this. Hello, son, Nif. Ah, we were talking about EA not refunding me some money. My GPU died and I had bought Andromeda, so I can no longer play Andromeda. Mass Effect Andromeda. They are trying to cheat me out of my money. Okay, let's take that gun. I cannot use it, but maybe someone can. Charcoal. Explosive grenade. Stun grenade. Dynamite. And bullets. Maybe I will find someone that can shoot a gun. Okay, son. How are you? Okay, so this dude said that that the priest lived where? I guess outside the cave. Well, coming to this cave was a good idea. If I ever restart as a ranged character, coming to this cave will be stop number one. You can bet on that. Okay, let's save. Let's call this melee dwarf. Alright, let's continue exploring this area. I might even lay a lamp. So what I thought was an... Uh, what? An, an orc is actually an ogre. Good. But I don't know if hard mode gets extremely hard afterward. But it certainly seems easy at the moment. This is the tutorial there, if you can even call it that. Ah. Okay, two enemies, let's see. Ah. Yeah, everything is going swimmingly, you could say. Actually, quite surprised. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I got a companion as soon as I started the game. Okay, let's look at the map, maybe... I don't know, he supposedly pointed to a map, but I have no idea where that could be. The map location, I should say. Weapon damaged. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's look at that. Weapon damaged. What does that mean? I don't see any indication this is damaged. Oh, 
really must be in my case there are absolutely no problems must be because it's the Intel GPU holy crap what the hell is this thing a kite shaman well that doesn't look like something I want to fight will I survive this encounter well if I cannot survive an encounter on the tutorial area I don't think I will survive outside this place this dude is going to murder my ass ok let's do something before there is something like a quick slot here no it doesn't seem like it so I have good ah fuck holy shit what the hell did he do At least the companion got the brunt of it. Surely, I haven't hit his ass. Okay, there we go. This is tough. It's good he doesn't look at me. Uh, 970 failed, nice. <laughs> if I get my money back, I'll buy a GPU. I think I can buy a 1050 Ti. That should be sufficient to play games, even if they look like crap. I can take at the teeth. Look at this! I need to remember you can st steal stuff from their bodies. A kite sword. I can't take that. Let's look at it. Wait, so I have a 2 to 7 fine steel dagger. 2 to 6, and so this is 2 to 6. I think good old dude here doesn't have anything good he has a 1 to 4 yeah let's say change that he can he cannot use it why there we go he has more damage I expect he has nothing why Jesus Christ Is he proficient with this weapon or what? No. Total attack 8. 2 2. What the fuck? Doesn't cause fatigue? Are you serious? Okay. The story so far is. Uh, let's see. He's Virgil. Sorry about that. Uh, the story so far is I was in a pleasure sepeling when a bunch of what I thought were orcs showed up in a plane and shot it out of the sky. Turns out it, they were ogres. And in the wreckage, there was a, 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 a gnome that gave me a ring and said I should give the ring to the one, whatever that means. And then this dude showed up, Virgil, and Virgil said my character is the one. My character is the one. Which turns out is the reincarnation of an elf. Or so they would tell me.
Yeah, I'm, well, Virgil says I'm the chosen one, but the gnome seemed to indicate I am not the chosen one. Okay, I think it's a bad idea to explore. In, well, night time no one sees me. They cannot hit shit either. Heal me, you asshole. Ah, great. He actually healed me. Well, I, I, I did tell him he was speaking nonsense. And if it's true that that religion is based around elven gods, then... I'm going to... What is it that you want of me? What type of healing do you... What type... No. I am finished. I'm going to... What is it that you want of me? My utmost to destroy that religion. And if the religion says I need to be good, then I will be evil. I will rebel against the religion. Yeah, this dude has combat skills, he can... He can heal. He seems very good. He's human, which is important for my character. Being human, either humans or gnomes. But elves are out of the question. This is really dark, isn't it? The only thing I'm not liking out the game is the way you cannot pan the screen unless you walk. That's annoying as shit. But other than that, the altar should clear things up for us a bit. Hmm. It says, uh... And the spirit of Nazaruddin shall be reborn on wings of fire in hills shrouded in fog, and fight the last battle with the evil one. <laughs> well, yeah, he's not afraid of anything, but he, he doesn't know much here. An evil one, who is that? I'm sorry, but I don't know. <laughs> I guess we better find out, considering you're supposed to fight him. Elves with disintegration are overpowered. I'm a racist in real life. <laughs> no, not really. But I like playing racist characters. Because they tend to be obnoxious and uh, it really simplifies role playing, you know. I don't have to think, ah, is this elf good? Is this elf bad? No, he's an elf. We hate elves. All elves. If they, if it has pointy ears and it smells like bathroom soap, he goes down. Whatever, this gets more ridiculous as we go along. I know you might not believe in all this, but I do. Might you show me a little more respect? No, I'm not going to show respect for that stupid religion. You can live whenever you feel the urge to do so. Well, maybe I will, you... No, that's going to get us nowhere. Fine, say whatever you'd like. 
I suppose you're entitled to your opinion. Yes, my opinion is that elves suck. Woo! Another hooded figure. Hold there, what are you doing here? Who are you to ask? What are you doing here? I mean no disrespect, uh, sir, but I don't trust this bastard one bit. Bloody convenient he just happened to show up here just now, don't you think? Oh, excuse my language, uh, sir. I guess I am, sir. I thought he was maybe talking to that dude. What do you recommend, Virgil? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not... Virgil, if he starts talking about his stupid religion and how I'm the reincarnation of some long-dead elf, I will push back for sure. What do you recommend, Virgil? I've uh, dealt with buggers, uh, <laughs> individuals like this before. Perhaps you'll let me talk with him for a few minutes. Of course, Virgil. Feel free to do what you think is best. Thank you. Uh, I'll take care of this. <clears throat> you there! What exactly are you doing up here? And what gives you the right to ask so many questions? I'm just asking a simple question. What are you doing up here? I'm from Shrouded Hills, a village not far from here. And I witnessed this terrible accident. It is such a crime to wonder what exactly is going on. Well, if he's from Shoudred Hills, he might know Virgil. Because Virgil comes from there, doesn't he? <laughs> oh, really? Listen, I came from Shrouded Hills myself. It's at least a day's journey from here. There's no way you could have traveled here that fast. I think you're lying, sir. Ooh. Uh, I didn't come from Shrouded Hills just now. I was camping not far from here and saw the place. Why are you questioning me? I have done you no harm. Yeah, the voice acting is great. I wish all the game was like that. That dude is amazing. Don't hate the elves. No, I actually like elves. But in my Inquisition playthrough, I play the racist elf. I don't, I don't have any problem with elves. I just pick a race and be, I am racist to someone. When I play Dragon Age Inquisition, I. I picked an elf and was racist to humans and, well, there were many dwarves, were there? And when I played Origins, I picked a human and was racist to all the other races. Okay, Virgil seems to be doing a lot of good reasoning here. Let's continue. No, I don't think you understand. I'm asking the questions here, and I don't like your answers. I'm going to ask you one more time. Why are you here? Yeah, the phone rang. Fail. A cold look comes across the man's face. I don't recommend you speak to me that way, friend. I have just asked a question, and I'm expecting an answer. He looks at me. Then back to Virgil. We can make this simple or more difficult. Ooh. What? This is Elf. Elf City Dweller. We're going to kill this bastard. For sure. I didn't notice. He said it's an Elf. Oh, I think difficult is the best way, sir. I find that there's fewer questions afterwards. I'm ready to begin this discussion whenever you are. The man seems... What? Why does it say man? It should say elf, but whatever. Seems unsure what to do. You see fear in his eyes. 
Perhaps this is a discussion we'll have later, friend. I'm sure that this issue will be resolved in time. He looks at you nodding, in his eyes a burning hatred. Good day to you, sir. Good day to you as well. <laughs> that that was close. Yeah, it was an elf, I didn't notice. <laughs> what do you mean, Virgil? He was obviously scared of you. That man very well could have killed us both. Believe me, I've seen his kind before. So, why did you provoke him? <laughs> it was all bluster. I'm no bloody warrior. But sometimes you have to be able to act the part. You learn such things on, on well, um... It's just something I've learned. Fear is a powerful weapon. Something is very wrong here. I think we'd best get out of here as soon as possible. All right. Let's go. Let's save as well. All right. Sir... You might wish to consult your map. I believe there might be a quicker way to Shrouded Hills. I don't think so, Ariel. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> well, if it's anything like Fallout, I do know what I'm doing. I know he's kind, yeah. Elves are pieces of garbage. Jesus H. Christ. Four wolves. Can I take on four wolves? I think I can. I wish I could shoot their asses. This is a lot of experience, but this is dangerous. Dangerous. Let's make sure it's only four. It seems like only four. I think I should be able to do this. It leads to great power in the dark side. Yes, it does. Jesus Christ! Okay, it hits hard. Jesus! Can I run? This was a bad idea. That thing hits hard as fuck. Die! Holy shit. Ailing wolf. Okay. This virgin managed to heal me. And I like the voice acting, I wish everything was voice acted like that. Just yeah, simple voice, it doesn't need to be much more than it. I guess he cannot heal me because he has fatigue up his ass. Alright, well that was a tough fight, amazingly enough. Ah, really? The people in, in, in Troika were ex fallout people? Amazing. This is a wolf. This is one of the tough ones. Jesus, but that wolf almost killed me. I could have died easily to that wolf. Uh, easily. Stupid. What is it that you uh, want of me? To right click on him. What type of healing do you want? What? No. I am finished. What is it that you want of me? Alright. Should I attack this wolf? 
Level 3. Ah, look at that. It does say the level of the enemies. Level 3. I'm level 1, I think. I'm level 2. Alright. Increase dexterity to 12. I guess I'll have to do it. I have to. It's the only reasonable thing I can do. I think Temple of Elemental Evil is what broke there. I, I actually watched once a playthrough of Temple of Elemental Evil. And they did, they, they, they did go bankrupt with the masquerade that that's the first game i ever played the masquerade rpg i mean great as game okay we're going to increase dexterity until 12. jesus is that what i truly want to do? dexterity Do I truly want to increase dexterity? Should I increase strength to 20? Maybe that's a better idea. Because so I'm missing quite a bit. The chance to land a damaging blow. Yeah, I'm missing quite a bit. I think... I think increasing meal is the way to go. I do a lot of damage, but I miss half the time. That's not... That's not a good thing. Let's increase dexterity. There is nothing else I can do, I think. Unless you have any other ideas in chat. Ah, uh, Masquerade was great. I, I actually played tabletop. Uh, world of Darkness as well. <laughs> really, son, if I played World... <laughs> I played World of Darkness at uh, the medieval setting, the masquer compared the masquerade. Well, I, I'm not crazy, I don't think I am. That's actually the reason I don't like... Okay, apparently no one has a better idea, so we're going with dexterity. The reason I don't I don't like Dungeons and Dragons is because I played Pen and Paper White Wolf first. Their Pen and Paper stuff is easy to understand. Oh. Ah, shit! Critical miss! This it didn't hit my ass. Kill it! Are you fucking serious? Okay, I need to heal. Uh, how do I heal? What? Only held up to 20 points. Are you fucking serious? Holy shit! I'm going to die. This is crazy. Can I run away? I think I can. Let's run away. Ah, oh, it's going to catch me. Maybe I shouldn't fight in darkness. How is it that I'm not hitting it? It's amazing. Holy fuck, Virgil just lifted me from death itself. Well, that was pure blind luck. Holy garbage. Virgil saved my ass. <laughs> Holy fuck. <laughs> nah, no problem, Sangrif. I, I, I'm just... 
and just uh, the this but yeah I, I actually played a lot of tabletop vampire the mask <laughs> and you know what running away always works for me really it's no. very difficult at the beginning well the truth is i'm fighting a, a character that's basically two levels above my own but I uh, I should have increased my dexterity to max instead of my strength because it doesn't matter if I hit them hard if I miss half the time no. and I end up hitting myself instead of them I actually did more damage than the wolf can do to me I did a truckload of damage to myself with that critical miss I thought I was going to die for sure. Shit! Okay, I'm not fully healed. What the hell is attacking me? Another freaking wolf. Level 3. Okay, let's wait until I'm healed at least. Ah, fail. Alright, because I'm a dwarf. Using a potion doesn't heal me. Alright, thanks a lot, Fail. That makes perfect sense, actually. Okay, it seems like he's alone. Ooh, not alone. Goodbye, I'm not going to risk two, two of those things coming at me. Esoterrorists. What is Esoterrorist? I haven't heard of that. Alright, let's take the short route there. Yeah, this seems like Fallout. So I press here. Then press here. Uh, here we are. Hello, Joaquim is staying at the inn next to the bank. All right, let's save. That was a close call. I don't think that's how you spell dwarf. Open your map, yeah, yeah, uh, there we go, I'm here now. So the, the inn, the temple door, the temple, the light wood door, I'm not going to explore a match. That's how I lose interest in old school games. It's too much content, I'm a compulsive explorer by nature. And old school games have so much stuff in them. The inn. Maybe the map will tell me where the inn is. No, it won't. Jesus. This map is completely useless, if you ask me. Jungles enchantments. But well, I don't have any money. Maybe I can buy a... a I, I need to go to... Yeah, to a... Smithy, maybe get the uh, uh, Slim's Pickens. What the fuck does that mean? Okay, let's enter here. Do I enter? Okay, there we go. Maybe I can buy a shield. I want a shield. Alright. What sort of wares do you carry? Take yourself a look, sir. I got good prices on common stuff. A little of everything you might say. Alright. Can you tell me about this ring I found? Or an exquisite ring, my friend. Hold on to it. <laughs> That's not how merchants work in real life. 
Ah, in modern day real world. That sounds interesting, son. I will research it. I haven't played tabletop for 12 years now. Shall we barter? Ooh, 800 coins. Jesus Christ. Let's see. Well, he... Gnome shopkeeper. What the hell is this? Fuel! Hmm. A rustic dress. A rustic finery. Give me a second, please. Okay, sorry about that. So, I, what can I use to heal myself that is not a potion? Because obviously healing potions don't work on me. Well, I don't like craft bit, I can tell you that. I prefer if I don't have to craft. You're very old by Twitch standards, but you're 40 maybe. That's very old. The the oldest streamer I've known is Qdos Back or whatever his name is. He's in his 50s or 60s. Perception plus one. Okay, it doesn't seem this dude has what I need. Just 300 coins. Ah, but I can sell a bunch of garbage. I forgot. You know what? Let's sell. Two coins? Is this guy serious? He's a complete asshole. Okay, I'm not going to sell weapons. But the matchbook. The passport. A broken... A gnome shop what? A stun grenade. Three fire resistance, damage resistance. I think these clothings are far better than what I have. A thousand coin, Jesus Christ. All right, a helmet, lose perception. Well, but this should, is not cheap. Fuck me, 500, what the hell is going on in this game? I can offer you 10 coins for saltpeter. I don't think I'm going to be going, I don't know, how can I craft? I don't even know how I can craft. Maybe I should sell these ingredients. If fail says I cannot craft. I don't even know how you can craft. I think you need schematics, possibly. So, why would I... Why would I stick with those things? Without the schematics. No 
know what? Let's sell this shit. If I can sell it, let's sell it. Let's sell this as well. I need that armor. What the hell is this? A fatigue restorer. Okay, no, I might need that. One day. A migraine cure. Who knows? I might get migraine. Okay, now I can buy this shirt. This dude is a freaking asshole. Ooh, or look at this. A sword. It causes fatigue. One, two, four. That means I could swing eight times. But after eight times, I could switch to my dagger. But it does a lot. Ah, uh, my dagger was two to six, doesn't it? It's not that much of an improvement. How the hell is this stuff worth so much? Okay. Yeah, my dagger does two to six. Let's take this clothing. He's he's a complete asshole, but I have to get as much armor as possible. All right. Let's get out of here. Why is there no music all of this sudden? Yeah, let's change the tuxedo. Yeah, I gained two resistance. That's good. Alright, let's go. So I'm looking for the inn. Ah, so you can just click inside and you go inside. I'm not going to steal, you never know. A smithy. Let's look at that. Dwarves, that should bury a lot of you. Holy crap. He hates me. And I said I was going to eat nice to humans and gnomes. Any other races I will treat like shit. The description said I would be courteous to humans and gnomes. Hate elves. And I'll treat the other races as they treat me. That should be... Okay. So... Excuse me, good sir. Is that any way for men of reason to speak? He seems to consider his words. People forgive... Please forgive the, out the outburst. Sometimes my mouth gets ahead of my brain. Already forgotten. Who might you be? Greetings, I'm Lloyd Gorlos, the local blacksmith. How may it help you? May I ask some questions? How can I help? What services do you provide? What services are you in need? I'm looking for training as an apprentice. What matter of training interests you? I have changed my mind, sir. I need trade. Well, this dude has the good stuff. No, no need for it. Um, hammer. Okay. A dread armor for six thousand coins. I cannot believe how expensive a stuff is. Must be because I don't have haggle. This is incredible. Truly is. It's amazing. Maybe I can sell this stuff to him. Uh, take it, you fucking asshole. Now let's keep weapons. Might need them for other characters. 
truly amazing. Okay, like, let's search for the the reset imported goods. I don't have money. I will postpone buying stuff until I have 500 coin at least. Where is this in? I'm looking for. He said it was next to the bank. I haven't seen the bank either. The first bank of Shrouded Hills. Alright. The Shrouded Hills in. Alright, here we go. We're looking for Joachim. The innkeeper, half orc, half ogre. The bartender. Joachim's room is at the end of the hall on the left. How much do you want to add? I'm going to get attacked as soon as I enter that place. Ah, well. Good God! What's happened here? These men, I, I've never seen them before. A bandit, villager. He has the hexagram amulet. So I'm guessing that's a cult or something. I've never heard of Exalted, to be honest. And Shadowrun, uh, uh, I only saw Shadowrun because Siri allowed me to to play it a little bit. Back then I had choices, so I didn't play. <laughs> I didn't play what? Joaquim's not too virgin. I didn't play games with no voice acting, but those days are over. <laughs> Alright, let's read that thing. Virgil, I assume you are not alone. As you can see, there are people in Shrouded Hills looking for me. Luckily for me, these felons were easily dispatched. Do not speak with anyone out the Zeppelin crash. Or your new companions in bold between. You. Sorry to interrupt, but it seems Joachim has discovered something. These individuals seem to be part of some larger plot. A plot against you. Okay. Tell me, Virgil, who exactly is this Joachim? He is, well, someone who helped me out when I needed it. I met him in a small village at a Panari temple. I was, uh, a bit down on my luck. He showed me that you don't always have to take what life gives you. That there's always a better path. And that it's always your choice to travel it. What do you mean down on your luck? What happened? He was a man whore. I I'd rather not talk about it anymore. But Joachim is a great man. Well versed in the ways of the Panari. And also in the ways of the world. If he thinks we're in trouble, then we are. Let's get out of here and get to Tarant. All right, Virgil. I'll talk more about this later. What is that rant, I wonder? Wait, he didn't let me read the freaking note. Let's look. When you are able to make your way to Tarant, check the telegram office there. I will leave you a message telling you where to contact him. All right. So let's go to Tarant. When are people going to attack me? I'm expecting an ambush anytime. Is that dude the ambush? No. Alright, so let's go to Tarant. Maybe the map? Need to get out of the local area or whatever the hell it's called. How do I do that exactly? do I get out of this map? Ah, there you go, world map. It went... The world map is not available? What? The hell that does that even mean? I will drown in the sea. So how do I fast travel to Tarant? 
let's look at the quest. Uh, the curse. I don't. I didn't see any guy with a curse. Rumors. Uh, Hello, Ranchi. Yeah, I don't really mind not finishing games anymore. I will just give it my best try to finish it. If I cannot, the game has defeated me. Why can't I fast run? There you go. The Arbalas House. Ah, that wasn't there before. Let's do that quest. Why not? Ooh, this doesn't look pretty. Jemima, beloved wife and mother. Alright. This headstone says, Saif, beloved son. How much do you want to add those bandits? Kill the, kill the priest's family. And he cursed them because of that. And I'm even playing in hard mode, Ronchi. <laughs> the hard difficulty. So far, it hasn't been that difficult. Ooh, level 10, and he's half elf. Jesus Christ, I have to kill him. But level 10 is way too difficult, I can assume. I'm level 2, impossible, I can kill his ass. So, how the hell do I get to Tarant? Where, where the hell is Tarant? This world is ginormous, if you are going to travel. Okay, is Tarant the telegraph office? Is there such a thing in Sir Shrouded Hills? He said, go to Tarant. Is Tarant a person or a place? I'm going to assume it's a place. You run into some bad orcs. Actually, I had run into works. The man before you is a youngish gnome. Excuse me, but I couldn't help but notice you're new here in town. I've heard about the Sefi where you on the blimp when it crashed. <laughs> He's a gnome, so I have to be courteous. Yes, I was. Oh, thanks heavens, there were survivors. Did the others come here as well? Where are they staying? No other survivals. I was the only one. Are you sure? My older brother, he was on the blimp. A gnomish gentleman of some years. Did you happen to see him, sir? I did meet a gnome. What did you say your name was? My name is Radcliffe, William Radcliffe. My brother was Preston. Did you know him, sir? Perhaps he's at the crash site, even now, alive. I spoke with your brother. He died shortly after. I'm sorry. No, not Preston. I see. Thank you, sir. You have been most helpful. Wait! He told me, find the boy and give him this ring. I see! This is a family heirloom. Even in death, he was thinking of family first. Shit. I wonder if this dude is actually... He said, give him the ring, he will know what to do. But he didn't say it was his brother. Okay, let's give him the ring. I have no other clue what to do, so... I think he wanted you to have it.
Thank you, sir. Here, please take this small token of my gratitude. It's not much, but this is all I have. Tell me, did Preston tell you anything before he died? He seemed very upset. He said he had escaped from somewhere. Really? Well, yes, Preston was getting on in years. Sometimes he had a little troll remembering exactly what, where he was. He was overseas receiving treatments. Good day to you. This dude just bamboozled me. The gnome looks at you for a moment, seeming to consider your words. Well, thank you, stranger. I'm sorry. What did you say your name was? I'm sorry. My name is Gloin. Pleasure to meet you, Gloin. I'll be staying here in town. Make sure we'll run into each other again. Yeah, that dude just fucked me in the ass. General Practitioner. I don't know. I guess I'll have to start exploring this place. Randomly. Let's enter the temple. Seems like the biggest... Building in town. But he said go to Tartafan or whatever. I don't see how I can get to Tartafan. Well, this doesn't look. What, the, what kind of temple is this full of rats? <laughs> what the hell? I don't seem to be able to find anyone, whatever. <laughs> Experience is gained from performance in combat, not the amount of combat. What does that mean? If I do better in combat, I get more experience. Why do I have more HP all of this? Uh, did I level up again? Yes, I did. Alright. I guess more dexterity is the way to go. So you can get HP by leveling up. Alright. I miss so much. Jesus Christ. It's absurd. So what did I get? New Joachim's letter. Ammonia. Magnesium. Okay, I'm 
I'm not going to start hoarding. That's that usually never leads to something good. The dwarf technologist. Is this a temple to technology or something? <laughs> Like my steam engine, it's mine. I keep it clean, I run it good. Ah, yes, I see, very pretty. Yes, it is shiny, see? I like steam, steam is hot, it makes funny noise. And you say you take care of this thing? It's a good machine, I fix good. You like? My steam engine is shiny! I see! Well, it is been mentally stimulating, but I must go. Okay... This is crazy. <laughs> Literally crazy. How is this a temple? I don't know. What do I do? This is interesting. Maybe this dude will have answers. What is it that you want of me? Can I ask questions? What can I answer for you? What should we be doing? Hmm. I think we should do two things. We should try and find the Elder Joachim and then find out who the owner of that ring is. Alright. The owner of the ring, that was the, the gnome. So I found him. Maybe he's a Dane, let's go to the Orden Bank. He's a gnome. After all. I don't know Ranchi. I, I, I don't understand my skills. My skills are not very interesting anyway. All this stuff seems way too complex. And I'm untrained on almost all of it. I don't like crafting too much. Let's see if I can find the gnome again. He said he was going to be around. So what do I do? Center the bank. This is again with the e sinking. This is amazing. Give me a moment, please. First bank of shrouded hills. What the fuck? Okay, so I can move the map. What what is this place? Huh, look at that. Interesting. If only I knew where the hell I'm supposed to be going. Let's go to these houses.
Yeah, I, I don't understand what it means here. What's this? The herbalist. What is it that you want of me? What can I answer for you? Hmm. I think we should do two things. We should try and find the Elder Joaquin, and then find out who the owner of... What is it that you want of me? Okay, we already know what Joaquin wants us to go to some place. There are two feet or whatever the hell it's called. But... It's not on my map. Let's see if it has appeared by a miracle. Do I have to just go walking? I might have to. This is the temple, which is no temple. Uh, those are random houses. This looks like complete useless stuff. You know what? Let's go to that... to that... bridge. Maybe I just need to find the way to Tartufi on my own. Ah, this is annoying as shit. Now, if anyone knows what I'm supposed to do, I know what I'm doesn't enjoy seeing me run around like a crazy person. I'm all ears. I think I'm going the right way, more or less. The path is Locked. What the hell does that do? Ah, oh, shit. Uh, I'm hitting far more now. Maybe having high dexterity was the right idea. That is closed. Let's go there. Okay, so you just have to click several times, no problem, I can do that. This certainly makes the game much more enjoyable, now that I understand how the map works. If you miss less, you will have more XP. Okay, who the hell is this dude? A human thief! They are level 3. Do I actually want to talk to... F Thieves. I don't think I want to. Why is he not attacking me? That's hilarious. Okay, so so having more dexterity will give me more experience rather than that fail because I I miss less. I honestly don't have any idea what I'm supposed to do. If you want me to be truthful. I don't understand exactly. Okay, let's wait until the global map icon appears. I found the 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 brother of Radcliffe or someone that claimed he was the brother of Radcliffe Why 
Where is the map? The, ah, there you go. The world map appeared. That's a strange thing. It is an arena. Yeah, I cannot see any Tartufi. Taratantos. Tanatos now. Kathian. I find out now. Where could it be? I love this pair. Okay, let's do this properly. I don't see any waypoint at all. Let's look at the journal and see if that gives me any indications. Apparently not. Well, this is interesting to say the least. You cannot do the same as Fallout, just press somewhere and go. You could do that on Fallout. Remember. Ah, I honestly have no idea what's happening. Okay, let's try to find the 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 what the gnome guy. He said he was going to be staying around. He's not in the inn. He's not from here either. Where could he be? Maybe he's in the square again. The town square. Not sadly I'll have to meta game it because I have no clue what I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, that was a small guy. No, but he was not dressed like a peasant. Yeah, that's a dwarf. Human guard. The general practitioner, what the hell does that mean? Seems like... Okay, sadly I, I will have to look it up. I have no idea what, what I'm supposed to be doing. Kind of makes you feel bad. Shrouded Hills is east. I am in Shrouded Hills, aren't I? I thought this is Shrouded Hills. Is this not Shrouded Hills? Well, if this, this is not Shrouded Hills East... Ah, you're telling me in this map it is East. Ah, okay. So you're saying I need to go East. Maybe to this burnt place. Okay, let's go. Thanks, Fail. 
I thought these were shrouded hills, it seemed logical to me. Okay, let's go to his burned down building. Maybe. Am I going. I'm going west! Shit, I'm going west right now. Whatever. Let's go there. I want to see what's that about. Is this him? a halfling. Show the hills is east of the tower. The tower, what tower? It's a mine. Let's go into a mine, why not? Shit! I thought someone was going to kill me. What is it that you want? What type of heat? What? I am finished. What is it that you wanted? Okay, let's explore this mine. A lantern. Doesn't blow up in my face. <laughs> yeah, I'm far better at hitting stuff now. To say, Shrouded Hills is east of a stone wall range. Okay, as soon as I get out of here, we're going to take a good look at the at the map, at the world map fail. Because I I thought I was in Shrouded Hills. That this settlement is shrouded hills. Ooh, what the hell is this? An L1? BC tune? What? What is a BC tune? How do I pass? Holy crap! What the fuck? Why did I hit it? It's a spectrum. I cannot hit it. That's worrisome. If I cannot hit it, I cannot shoot it. How the hell do I kill it with electricity? Okay, I'm going to loot everything I got. Two. Okay, let's take that. Capacitor and copper ring. Right. Yeah, let's loot everything and go. I'm going to fight that thing. Whatever the hell it is. I am in shrouded hills. But you're saying I need to go to a place east of the settlement itself. If I understand correctly. I think I just need to get used to how the map works. And I should be fine for the other days. What is it that you want of me? 
What type of healing? What type? I am fit. What is it that you want of me? Ah, shit. What is it that you want? What type? What? Type? I am finished. What is it that you want of me? The Virgil is supremely useful, I have to say. Does he level up? He's level 3. They have been leveling him up. Ah shit, they're leveling him up automatically, fuck me. What the fuck have they been doing? At least they are putting points in healing. I think I should level him up on my own. Yeah, let's stop this thing. Oh, shit, I think I cannot. He levels, he auto levels up no matter what. Jesus Christ. I cannot stop them from leveling him up. Or whatever. But that's why it seems to me anyway. Alright, let's finish exploring this place. Yeah, fighting has become considerably easier now that they actually hit people. Who knew dexterity was so important even for that? Ah. Oh, that's hilarious. Trap. A poison. For 24? What? Turns? Twenty four what? Steps? Seconds? Well, I need someone with perception, that's for sure. Can I lead what is the party with mean? people now? Maybe it was seconds. Seems like an eternity. Ooh, massive spider. Spider is extremely difficult. Which makes sense with a knife? Yeah. I would say it's difficult. Okay, I think I have a grasp of many mechanics now. Holy shit, okay, let's wait until I'm healed. What is it that you want of me? What type of what I am finished? What? The hell did just happen? Get my die from there. What is it that you want of me? What Kill type me, of you what asshole? Type of I am finished. What? Ah, he's... Shit. Okay, let's drink this. Holy crap. <laughs> the asshole doesn't have any fatigue, okay. Wait until I'm fully healed. Fatigue is important. Although I've never depleted my my stat bar, but I guess it's because 
that's because I use an anchor that doesn't cause fatigue. But what I'm intrigued to bullets cause fatigue. TH What the hell is TH to hit? I'm best betting it's to hit possibly. Jesus Christ, don't leave you alone, don't they? What is it that you want of me? What type of... what type... I am finished. What is it that you want of me? What type of what type of healing do you I am finished? What is it that you want of me? Ugh. Are you blind? What in God's I I mean better luck next time. Bye. 
Well, yeah, it was a close one, Ranch, wasn't it? This fatigue business is going to be an annoyance. Because it, I don't understand why does it record so slowly out of combat? What the hell is happening? It won't. It's just as slow as shit. It kind of reminds me of of uh, Knights of the Old Republic, the first one. The force points regenerate as low out of combat but I cannot I can no longer fight did you see what happened there did the uh, virgin queen heal me because because he ran out of fatigue points so I cannot explore until I have full fatigue full health actually save. Alright, let's start our writing. If I start again, do I want, I don't know, the way the game is showing itself, I think, yeah, I would, I would change a few things. I will think of you, change a few things if I restart, for sure. Dexterity is far more important than I originally thought. And I don't think I'm going to arrange character because the enemy is just close to you. The only good thing about using a gun is that fatigue doesn't go away. But you have to buy bullets and everything is so expensive, ridiculously expensive. Okay, regenerate fatigue. Let's count. 1 Mississippi, 2 Mississippi, 3 Mississippi, 4 Mississippi, 5 Mississippi, 6 Mississippi, 7 Mississippi, 8 Mississippi. 8 seconds for 3 points. Which means it takes far more than a minute for it to regenerate fully. Craziness. Well, a minute is not long unless you're doing absolutely nothing. But I cannot explore, I cannot do shit. What is it that you want of me? What type of you? What type of I am finished? What is it that you want of me? Alright, let's just start exploring carefully. If I see an enemy, I just have to stop. Okay. Fatigue restore. Those are for him. I should give those to him. Silver ring. Oh, yeah. Let's give him the fatigue restores. I guess we're done here. And an identified dagger, another one, huh? Alright, let's get out of this mine. A trap, huh? So, Vail is saying go east of the tower. Problem is, I haven't seen any tower. look at the map closely. Maybe I will see the tower now. Go east of the tower. A tower. Is this the tower? If I go east of the tower, I'll end up in the river. This is closed. I guess I need to talk to that bandit. Is that what you're telling me, Fail? Need to talk to the bandit and his two ogre companions. They're going to wreck me. 
I can tell you that right now. They're going to fuck me. Two ways to Sunday is what you say. Three ways to Sunday. Why can't I swim? If I could cross right here. Now obviously I have to go to the to the bridge. Alright, let's go to the bridge and get killed. I'm going to die, I can feel it already. I'm going to get owned hard. Those ogres are going to wreck me. That was a stupid detour, but what can you... If only I could tell the companions to go to the last location and the game figure out the r proper route. I think I'm going to stop shopping until I have like a thousand gold. Each time I have a thousand gold and go and shop. Alright, time to die. Pretty sure I'm going to die here. A wolf is giving me trouble. Two ogres and a thief are going to kill me. For what is sure. it that you want of me? What type of what? No. I am finished. What is it that you want of me? Yeah, these dudes are going to murder my ass. Dwarfs, come! I don't speak with your kind. Who said that? I'm guessing he's the thief. He's human, so I have to be courageous. Allow me to make amends. Look at the witless. Master Thief isn't known for his patience. And you! How could I possibly speak with one of your obvious, inferocious demeanor? <laughs> Great look and Prince of Thieves accept my humble apologies. Well, now that you put it that way, your manners must just be saliva, saliva, channel. What? <laughs> I'll give you a chance, I suppose. Thank you so much. May I ask you something? What do you want? Luca has little time for trophy matters. I need to cross the bridge. Ah oh yes, the bridge. That's a different matter. You see, my friends and I have found it at Panatarius to require of travelers a small toll for the use of our bridge. You can be assured the funds are beneficial to our little group here. Perhaps is there a way we can circumvent the fee? Perhaps, perhaps, there may be something you could do for me. It seems my reputation here in town has grown expositionally. I'm having trouble acting without the local constable constant attention. By the fiscal, yeah. <laughs> I 
If only people like that wrote the dialogue for RPGs of the current era, everything would be great. I see how could I be of assistance. The locals don't seem to appreciate the toll I'm charging here. They've gone and begun preparations for another bridge to the south. If I were... If there were some way you could implode their efforts, I would appreciate it. We could even make you an honorifico member of our crew. How exactly would one impede their efforts? Shrouded Hills has recently received a shipment of construction materials, lumber and whatnot. They are located right next to the bridge. If you just destroy them, I'll wave the toll for you. I'll be going now. Okay, let's see. I will either help them build the bridge or destroy the bridge. One of the two to the south. Let's see if we can find. Betting is this place. It would have been easier if someone said Tartufo is on the other side of the bridge or to the east or something. That should be a total word. <laughs> uh, maybe. Well, the, there is no one even guarding this shit. Okay, I think I'm going to destroy it. Money is more important. How do I proceed to destroy this stuff? If I had fire or something... Can I throw a lantern on them? I, I remember the game telling me I could throw stuff. If I can throw a lantern on it and it will break and burn it down? I have no idea. How does it work exactly? I remember reading out it, but now I cannot do it. Okay, let's get far away from that. If I'm going to throw a grenade, I'm not going to throw it right next to me. Why not? Let's try a grenade, an explosive grenade, or the dynamite. Let's try the dynamite. Uh, nothing happened. Shit! I killed him! What? What the hell did just happen? I killed Virgil! Oh, fuck. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, this is amazing! Holy Christ. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Virgil, no! How do I revive his ass? Jesus Christ. Well, now I'm fucked. <laughs> Hello, Spectralist. <laughs> well, now I'm truly fucked. There is no way I'm going to survive without Virgil. 
unless I find another mage. Alright, let's go and talk to this dude. Fuck. That's hilarious. But yeah, I'm 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 this playthrough is going to end soon. Or this attempt I should say. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing! And I did go away. I I thought the dynamite might kill me, so I retreated. But I didn't think Perugin was in any danger. Turns out I was wrong. Yeah, Spectres, this is my first attempt. This is a blind playthrough. I I haven't played the game before ever. Why are you with me again, dwarf? Alright. I have already done so. Really? A splendid! A most for two tedious situation. You have my most heartfelt thanks, and you can pass along the bridge anytime. He gives you a key. You might just make a good thief, my friend. In fact, I must just have some information. I'll be coming one if you're interested. I would be very interested in any advice you might have. <laughs> Hello. Ah, thanks, Spectrum. It's knife. I've been playing permadeath playthroughs for two years now. All games I do permadeath. So I have become quite cautious in gameplay. And I try to build characters for combat, mostly. And, and I have been close to death several times already. Like four hit points left or less. But I read the manual yesterday, spent the whole cast reading the manual. Well, half the manual. So I have a good understanding of the mechanics. But stuff like that, I. For example, because I read the manual, I knew I could throw the dynamite, but I didn't see the character throw it, so. <laughs> I was surprised when it exploded in my face. Alright, what do you have? I'm not quite sure where you're headed, but just about any first sized metro cloth light should have what is known to those in the know as the Thieves Underground. What exactly is the purpose behind this organization? The Underground is compromised of many groups of thieves all across the contingent. <laughs> Any one of these groups will know of jobs that are available, and they make sure that no two thieves are doing the same job at once. Across the continent, eh? Huh? Sounds pretty established. Very, and very secretive. They won't just talk to anyone either. You've got to be subtle and silent, you know, very thief-like. Look, and I don't think you've made one mistake in that sentence. What do you mean? Nothing. In any case, if you go to Tarant or any of the larger cities, any casual increase in the local tavern should get you some instantaneous results. My thanks, you're a gentleman or a scholar, maybe. Goodbye. Alright. Yeah, those wolves almost killed me. What else? The wolves... The... Oh, it was mostly the wolves. Home city dweller. Uh, he was here, fuck me, and I was searching for him in town. That's amazing, truly. <laughs> Okay, 40 more minutes of gameplay. 
Oh, Mr. Radcliffe, what is it you need? Remember me? Oh, good, listen, I just wanted to thank you for being so forthcoming about Preston and the ring. It was very important that I knew everything about what happened on that blimp. I, what the hell does blimp mean? I, I, I heard that word air before. Are you sure you don't know anything else? Not that I can remember. Well, holy shit, I knew it! I knew it, I knew he was lying. But I had to be nice because he was a gnome. He dodged. Ah, so dodge actually works. IFS Zephyr has crashed just outside Shrouded Hills. Kill Radcliffe if he is still alive. As we don't know who has spoken to kill any other survivors. Limp is an air balloon for people. Ah, okay. So it's like slang for Zeppelin or. We call them dirigibles down here. Uh, but yeah, for anyone that has heard of Led Zeppelin, it would be better to just call it a Zeppelin. Okay, more dexterity so I can increase melee. Do, do people call it Dirigio? Dirigius? Up. Okay, so I guess I just go east. Still nothing. Is there a... Why is there no... Interesting. There is no road itself after the ridge. That's hilarious. I, I, uh, arcade technical difference between all those things. I'm sure it is. I'm sure there is a difference. Could be sizes, could be material, could be all sorts of stuff. So I cross the reach, and I'm still lost. <laughs> Isn't this great? I think I could run forever and ever to the edges of the map. Nothing will happen. It just seems like random wilderness. It is amazing, you know? Yeah, I could just run and run, can't I? Okay, let's see. Completed. In order to join the thieves, you must destroy the construction materials. Uh, I completed it. You know what? This is odd. I cannot believe what I'm seeing. This is a true old school game that doesn't really give you any hints, is it? Amazing. Truly amazing. It's far more... Even though it's after Fallout, this is far more... 
hand, a far more hands off approach. In Fallout, I never remember being lost, you know. But here, I have no clue where I'm supposed to go. The map doesn't give me any. I know I have to go to Tartufu, but how the hell do I get there? That dude had a note in him and just says that someone is trying to kill all the survivors, which basically means kill me. So now that I think, isn't it strange that this dude Virgil showed up? Because he was in immediately upon the wreckage. He was so suspicious about someone else showing up a little bit later. It's actually extremely suspicious that he shows up so quickly. I mean, Virgil himself. Okay, the generals are the collective name for rigid type airships. Zeppelins are semi rigid, and blimps have no rigid internal structure. So, blimps are basically. Balloons with something attached down under. A big ass glove, you could say. This is crazy stuff. Crazy. So I cross the bridge and do what exactly? Holy fuck. I truly cannot believe it. If, for example, if I had play tested this game, I would have told them make a road, just like there is on the other side of the map. Make a road. So the the player knows what to follow. The only thing I can follow is the river basin. Want a hint? I am actually... I know I'm going to die. I, uh, I don't know if I'm going to get another healer, but if I don't get another healer, I am going to die. I was actually thinking of going and fighting that dude. But I'm going back to the, to the bridge. I don't even know if I can finish the quest now that I killed Virgil. <laughs> Let me go back to the bridge if I can find it. But it's amazing how big these maps are. I would think they just finish somewhere. Let me go back to the bridge and reassess the situation. But yeah, if I cannot figure it out, I would definitely uh, appreciate a hint. But this character is doomed, unless I get a... A, a what? Unless I get a, a healer. I'm... Okay, here we have the map. So, I went all the way here, nothing happened. Let's f follow the northern coast. If there is any reason to believe, I will find a city that would be following the coastline. Maybe that's the... the road I've been talking about. Just follow the coastline. But it's amazing how big this map is. I'm truly surprised. Now I'm back at the... If I'm at the glow map, then I've gone too far, I think. That's what they say in the manual. If you're in a, you're either in a town map or in the glow map. I'm 
Oh, this, this is all glow map. Jesus. So what do I know? Is this the rich? No, that's can't, that can't be a rich. What I truly don't understand is why that city has not appeared. Do I have... Does someone have to tell me? I think that's the only explanation. I need to talk to someone that will tell me exactly where Tartufu is. Just like someone told me where Arbala's house was. It's the only way. Ah, shit! Are you serious? Well, I'm going to get owned. That thing ran away, I'm not going to fight it. So, roaming the wilderness is not a good idea. Let's remember that. How do I clean the... the shit, how do I clean this? Okay, there we go. Let's go to Shrouded Hills. So I need to talk to someone that knows where Tartufu... That's my... that's my game plan. I'm going to try to do that for the next 30 minutes. Find someone that knows where that city is. Let's see if they bank. Maybe they bank. Bank Taylor, human guard. Let's talk to this dude. Hello, welcome. How can I help you? I'm just passing through. Maybe a bartender. The people in means are usually knowledgeable. You are a stone brain dwarf if I ever saw one. Do you always greet your new patrons in such a manner? We don't serve your type here. Remove yourself from the premises or I'll be forced to call the guard. Holy crap. Never mind. That dude is not going to tell me shit. Ah, now I know why you wanted to go to the wilderness. There you can heal. You know what, let's go to the wilderness for a second so I can heal. They say in towns, when you're in a town map, you cannot heal by resting. You have to pay for for the privilege, but out here in the middle of nowhere. You can't do exactly that. Alright. Now let's wait until it is daytime. Until morning. So let's try to find someone that knows where that place is located. I think I'm going to be... Should I be thorough? I think I should. Okay, I have entered this place. Maybe a general practitioner will know something. Hopefully he does. Let's go there. I actually kind of like not having a clue of what's happening. You only get frustrated if you have no idea what you're supposed to do. I don't mind running around like a headless chick trying to find information. So let's see if anyone knows where this place is located. Get out of my sight, dwarf! <laughs> I think it's because I'm 
ugly a dirty one hates me. <laughs> Please excuse my intrusion, sir. I meant no offense. I don't generally speak with those of your kind, son. I didn't know humans were so racist. Amazing. I would be most appreciative were you to make an exception for me. Pretty well. I can see that you know your place. Ooh, <laughs> lovely dialogue. What can I do for you? <laughs> Amazing. I love those dialogues. Yeah, everyone hates ugly dwarves. Know your place. Okay. Uh, who might you be, sir? If I ever play an orc, it would be nice. If I ever lower the difficulty, I'll play an orc. A half orc, and I'll... ...kill all the humans that insult me. Yeah, I, I saw that. My place is dancing on your grave, dog. If I were a half orc, I almost chose a half orc. If I were a half orc, I would choose that option in a second. Half orc that hates humans. I think that will be the next, the next, I, if I die, I'll lower the difficult, now, should I lower it, I don't know, if I, if I die it's because I killed Virgil with <laughs> the dynamite, I'll think on it if I die, alright, who might you be, I'm called Doc Roberts in these parts, who might you be, I'm Gloin, well Gloin, if there is nothing else I'll be thanking you to get along, is there any work to be had around here? This weird old man looks you over as if appraising a potential you might accidentally possess. There might be something if you don't mind putting your hide in danger. I'm not arsed to danger, provided the pay is right. Word has reached me that Bowen Gang is coming to rob the bank. Do that for them that my money happens to be there too. So what do you need? I could use someone to watch my back, and there ain't no one worth their salt in this town. Sounds intriguing, what will you pay? Well, that depends, Gloin. Do you fancy yourself a magicker or a scientist? I'm partial to the ways of technology. Well, in that case, I have a finely made pistol here that I could let you have afterwards, were you to back me up when the troll starts. <sighs> ah shit, he's level 30! <laughs> yeah, I didn't notice that spectralist. He's a level 30, well, that would be hilarious, he could kill me in a second. <laughs> Level 30. Okay, I need to be mindful of that number. I only discovered it existed like an hour ago. I'm intrigued by your offer. What would I need to do? Meet me in front of the back. I'm keeping an out for the troll. When it does start, I'll expect you to buy my side. Alright. Well, if that dude is going to have troll, then I'm going to be murdered by those people. Okay, so the general practitioner knew nothing. Let's go into this house. Someone has to know where that freaking place is. Is there no tourist tourism board? Dwarves, they should bury a lot of you. Please, I only wish information. I don't know, I'm not fond of those of your ilk. If I only could have a simple moment of your time. Well, as long as we know where we stand, what is it you need? 
May I ask a question? What do you need? Anything unusual I should know about? I saw Jacob Benz slouching around the inn. I don't trust that man. Okay, whatever. I need someone to tell me where that place is so I can travel there. The herbalist. An elf! I cannot talk to elves. No way. Can I kill her? What level is her? She's level 24, Jesus Christ. Find them for a bed and pay for it, fucking assholes. Okay, another place. Uh, this is the metal works. This is. Okay, let's go to these uh, shops. And then I'll swing by the bank. Well, if that's the case, if, if random M human NPCs are so high level, then I cannot be an orc. No way, I would have to respond with anger, and they will kill my ass faster than I can say restart. Human villager. What is it, you ignorant dwarf? <laughs> Sir, we've just met and have already such harsh words. Ristes is a good man, but something about you gets under his skin. Be gone. Please, let's try to work this out. Or perhaps you're still rather revolting, although maybe in a way that your chakas cannot help. I'm trying very hard to impress you. Alright, you've won me over. Perhaps you are told at all. May I ask who you are? I'm Ristes. Ha! Huh. He was talking on the third person. Importer of fine goods and rarities from all over the world. Nowhere will you find a more Incredible assortment of fantastical oddities from the fourth corners of Arcanum and beyond. Looking for something specific? Fascinating, God, you answer questions. What can I do for you? I have this ring! Huh. Interesting, a finely made piece of jewelry. What exactly do you want from Ristes? Do you know who the initials GB belong to? GB, no one that I know. Plus, it's impossible that someone in Shrouded Hills would know, would own such a high piece of jewelry. More likely, they would make it down and use it for nails. The thought, how Ristes has languished here, my friend. Would anyone else in town know who it might belong to? Just wait a minute, friend. Perhaps Ristas has some questions for you. Like, where does someone like yourself come across such a piece? It was given to me by a victim of the Blim Crash. Blim Crash? What Blim Crash? Has no one the decency to tell Ristas tra when tragedy strikes? Are you alright? Were there any more survivors? No, it seems I'm the only lucky soul. I see, while Ristes is always one to help those in need. Take this as small donation. <laughs> Ristes is a businessman, but he has a heart as well. Tell me, were there any objects that seemed well unclaimed? Perhaps, let's talk about that in a while. Ah, man after Ristes' heart. Now, what else can Ristes help you with? I would like... I would like to ask out the imprint of P. Schuyler and Sons. P. 
be Shugler and Sons are an important piece of puzzle, eh, my friend? Ristez has been very free with information now. What have you to offer Ristez? You have been nothing but helpful and very knowledgeable. Ristez sees through your poorly <laughs> attempt to coerce him through flattery. I'm not new to the wild so fast talking men. Let's cut to the chase. Ristez has information you need. Ristez needs something in return. Fine, what is it you're looking for? Well, Ristez is a collector of strange and wonderful things. Perhaps there are a few objects that you could add to Ristez's collection. What are you looking for exactly? Two things, actually. If you were able to locate a camera, I do have one. Or something of Bessie Toon. I actually have both of those things. I might tell you about B. Schuyler and Sons and where you might find them. Sounds fair. Both, fortunately, I have both. Excellent, my friend. And which of them would you like to trade for the information about B. Schuyler and Sons? Ah, shit. Can I go to my inventory? No. I, I think the camera it is busted. Maybe USD Sons boot is uh, something I can't wear. I didn't notice if it's if it's wearable. I think the camera, here you go. Wonderful! Ristez shall tell you what you want to know. Then, P. Schuller and Sons is a well-respected jeweler in Tarant. There you go, this dude is going to tell me where Tarant is. A strange family, but they always do good business. And here, Ristez shall make Mark Tarant on your map. Their address in the city is 44 Devonshire Way. Good luck, my friend. Thank you, Ristez. Good day. Holy shit, we managed to do it. That's amazing. Now it's time to die. No, not really. Alright, so I have a quest. I'll, I'll do this quest. Let's find people here. But I'm going to save. That is amazing. Freaking virgin. Is there any way to revive people? I wish... I wish there was. But if there is, it's going to cost more than 266 gold. There you are! Are you right to throw in with me? I haven't seen the boys roll into town, but that doesn't mean they ain't here already. I am ready! Jesus, he joined me? Amazing! He's level 30, I, I hope I can coerce him to stay. Damn, they sleep inside somehow, let's put these six fools under. I'm with you. Is he going to follow me? He is! Ha ha ha! Fuck, fuck your quest, I'm going to take him. What? Great. They thought out everything. <laughs> I I thought I could do an Oblivion. I remember in Oblivion I I was doing a quest uh, and I got a companion and I just went around doing the stuff with him because I wanted a companion. He was unkillable. He was the son of Tiber Septim. Turns out in this game you cannot do that. Time to run away, that guy is going to kill my ass. Shit! <laughs> He's shooting. Okay, I need to... <laughs> this game is amazing. I didn't think the developers were going to pull something like that. Can I end combat? Is he going to hate me forever? 
Completed tristes. Accepted to gain information. I survived. I'm surprised. <laughs> Is that dude going to keep trying to kill me? That's. I actually want to do his quest. Just thought. I could run around with him for a little while. Doc, don't kill me, please! Ah, shit, he is going to kill me on sight. There is no way I can murder his ass. Alright, let's go. Let's go to Tar Tamful. Shit, now he's actually following me. Okay, there you go. Agro has been broken. Maybe I can go inside the bank. No, if I go inside the bank, I'm going to die. Alright, let's go to Tartuffles. Or whatever it's actually called. I'm, I'm amazed I'm actually alive. Who? Who is that woman? Maybe I can recruit her. Shit! Stop, you asshole! Alright. A human villager. Fuck me. Dwarves are the worst. <laughs> Let's barter, my good woman. 3,000 racist humans. How am I supposed to get any of this? Alright, I'm going to try something. I'm going to fight these cows with the... With the... Pistol. I want to see how pistols work. I am not untrained on pistols. I just want to see how ranged weapons work. So I guess I have 15 bullets. Alright. So, how do I enter combat? Jesus, 17 to hit? <laughs> Holy fuck, no! I haven't done a single... Are you fucking serious? 50% damage. And it broke. Okay. This is amazing. It broke. Well, I don't think I'm going to be using ranged weapons. The the combat system doesn't seem to favor them. If you ask my opinion. Uh, that That's hilarious, all this stuff. And I actually enjoy this, this roleplay. The, what the hell is that thing? That wasn't there. I didn't loot his ass, did I? He had an amulet. And a dagger, let's take the dagger. Being a subservient dwarf that will only stand up to elves. Okay, now I should be able to go to Tartifus. Is it Tarant? Okay, let's remember that. So I to say Tartuffles. Tarant. I'm going to get ambushed in the middle of nowhere. Shit. What? I don't have my dagger.
going to wait for it to come. Alright. I'm going to sleep here until healed. I hope I don't get ambushed. Alright. Doesn't seem these maps have anything to loot. Let's continue to Tarrant. Oh. Ah, amazing. Okay, sleep until healed. We're going to be doing a truckload of that. I need a healer. I need fast. Ooh, a level ten ruffian. I'm going to get murdered. Looks like this is the end for you. No one escapes Molokian's hand. It would have been better for you if you had not survived the crash of the Zephyr. Ah, shit. What? I'm not the person you're looking for. Really? He leans in close to you, as if to study your reaction to what he's out to say. I picture you as someone who would accept his fate bravely. For some reason, not attempt to escape by lying like a coward. <laughs> no matter. Prepare to die, dog. Please, no! He's going to kill my ass. Shit. I cannot even hit him. That's it. All right. What time is it? No, I cannot create the character today, but tomorrow we shall restart. I'm going to restart on the hardest difficulties. Yeah, I, I don't think I had any chance to survive that. Now I understand that dexterity is very important. I, I should have max dexterity, but it doesn't matter if I hit hard, if enemies... If I cannot hit them, actually. I don't hit most of the time. And I'm having a serious problem with... You know what? I want to do something. Let's do something just to test. I want to test something. I will restart tomorrow, but I want to test... Uh, the fight against the elf in the hut. That shouldn't take long. But yeah, I think I need to max dexterity. And melee... And melee... Chance, or whatever you want to call it. So I can actually hit people. Okay, I cannot enter. Let's wait until morning. And I... I'll, uh, I just want to see... Is l anyone level 10 actually... Impossible for me to kill. Yeah. I could kill him, amazing. That is truly amazing. I could 
kill he says surprising honestly maybe it's because he now let's try to f do I have Tarant on the map already? I think I should okay let's see if I can get more, more luck in to attack me again I want to see how consistent is my death And I will restart tomorrow. I think at the same difficulty. The path is blocked. You must locate near a bridge. Ah, amazing. Okay, I have five minutes. I can deal with five more minutes. At least after that, I have to go. Where is the. Earth is immoral. <laughs> I'm immoral. <laughs> no, not really. But yeah, I did g good, I think. Uh, for a first time try. But yeah, tomorrow we shall basically catch up. And I'm going to max out dexterity. Max out this dexterity and melee combat. I don't think fatigue is as important as I thought. I could just use weapons that don't cause fatigue. So I don't dump points into that. Let's see if the dude attacks me again. Morlock's hat. I hope he does. Torque's altar. Okay. Attack me, you stupid fuck! Ah, seriously. That was a random event? So I died to a random event. Level 10 asshole showed up. But that's great. Look at that, I miss, miss, miss. I need far better hit. I need to hit almost every time. Okay, I'm at the rat. Let's go back to Shrouded Hills. I actually want that dude to ambush me. Two misses. Nail 8, Kite Berserker. These dudes are going to murder me. <laughs> Amazing, not a single hit. It says I should hit for every two swings I should hit one and it's not happening. Alright. So yeah, that's it for this attempt. But tomorrow we shall begin a new. I don't, I'm not going to lower the difficulty. I died because I don't have this dude around me. But uh, now I know more about how I should expect my dwarf. I actually like that subservient dwarf roleplay. So, uh, 
I hope I'll see you tomorrow. I just need to use weapons that don't cause fatigue or minimal fatigue. And I should be okay. Thanks a lot, Siri, Spectralist, Ronchi, Fail, for all your feedback and interesting talk about tabletop RPGs. I hope I'll see you tomorrow when we shall continue with our little quest here. Until then, have a pleasant day. Goodbye. And thanks for watching.